This will be a sparkling spring water freeze test between the brand new Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus, as you can see, versus the iPhone XS Max. Now, both of these phones are IP68 water and dust resistant. So I'm just a bit curious to see how they can handle a little bit of sparkling water here, as you can see. Crystal Geyser Sparkling Spring Water natural lemon flavor so we'll be putting these phones in the ice box we'll test out the durability okay so let's have a quick look at the phones starting with the s10 plus as you can see this is the ceramic white version so have a look ceramic white with the black lettering on the back i think the prism white has white lettering and obviously the prism white will have the color shift this one does not have that so take a look and up front we do have a white stone dome glass installed on this phone so we'll also be testing the durability of this screen protector gonna see if it'll separate from the phone so let's have a look so you can see fingerprint scanner works etc Check out that wallpaper though. Very nice. All right, we'll put that, put that down. And we'll have a quick look at the iPhone XS Max in the gold colorway, so you can see. And there you go. Very nice. Okay, so this is our liquid for today, the sparkling water. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't want to make a mess in my kitchen now. And let's go ahead and pour. Oh boy. It's about right. Okay, I have a little bit left. Oh no, it's not enough. The iPhone has more liquid than the S10. That's an unfair test. Nah, bro. Got another one. Don't trip. Woo. Look at that. Whoa. All right, so pour a little bit more here on the S10 Plus. All right, is that about even? Because, you know, got to make a fair test, right? Okay, a little bit more on the S10. A little bit more on the S10. Okay. Is that about right? Let's have a look. Yeah, it looks good to me. There you go. Cool. Very nice. That's, uh... Have a look at the display. Turn this on. Oh man. Do the same thing on the 10. Now I wonder if the fingerprint scanner will function under these conditions. Let's test it out. Kind of doubt it, but nope. All right, well iPhone XS Max, Galaxy S10 Plus, you're going in the icebox. Get my lid. Why is this not? There you go. Nice. All right, so. Where's my ice box? Here's my ice box. LG, LG G8 coming soon, along with the LG V50. So look for those in the channel soon. But anyways, here's the ice box. Got a space right there. So I'm gonna first take my, hey, you wanna help me out? 
Yeah, what is she doing? You want to go in the icebox? This is Zimba, by the way. My main coon. As you can see. You want to help? Hey, well, you don't go in the freezer. What are you doing? Anyway, here's the iPhone. That goes in the icebox. And the Galaxy S10 Plus. There you go. Both in. All right. Where's my um? Let me grab my Note Nine. My Note Nine. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually, what am I doing? Um. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on a second. Okay. So here's my Note Nine. So you can see. I'm gonna go ahead and start the stopwatch on that. Okay. Very good. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and just let that freeze. Now let that freeze, and we'll go check on the phones in a few hours. I'll see you in a little bit. And I am back, as you can see, 10 hours and some change later. It's the next day. The sun is out, etc. Beautiful day out, by the way. So anyway, here we go. 10 hours later. Put the Note 9 to the side, and um, let's see what we're dealing with. Uh, let's go. And open this up and oh check this out nice and frozen as you can see two phones in there in their respective container all right so let's uh see what we're dealing with here this one is the um whoo that is hard whoo and then take this one out I don't even know which one's which. Close the icebox. Thank you, LG. Till next time. Oh man, that is rock solid. Hear that? Man. Okay, this one is the... I have no idea which phone this is. I can't even tell. Yeah, I don't know. And then this one, I don't know either. I'm gonna say this one's the iPhone because it's the gold frame. All right, so let's see. Um, uh, open this up. Woo! Oh man, oh, this is the iPhone, right? Yep, that's the iPhone, as you can see camera right there etc and then this one is s10 plus ceramic as you can see all right so let's go ahead and um let's just do it this way shall we nice and frozen very nice take my hot water off which i've already heated and um let's start melting these bad boys as you can see There we go. Hear the ice melting away, cracking, etc. All right, very good. Uh, there we go. Put this one to the side, and then we'll do the same thing to the S10 Plus. So you can see. Woo! There we go. Now, can I get the phone out? No, I cannot. Need a little bit more warm liquid. We'll go ahead and just do it like this. There you go. I think that should do the trick. That's, uh, well, maybe not. Maybe a little bit more. <laughs> Woo! Crazy AF. Well, it's on. Is that Siri? Okay, so the phone works. But, okay. What about the 10? Here's the 10. 
have a closer look. Phone still looks pretty good. We'll flip it over and, oh, I see it turned on, right? Let me see. Oh, the phone survived. What? I'm telling you, man, these phones nowadays, IP68 rating, they can take a beating. All right, let's see if the fingerprint scanner, see my hand, my thumb is kind of wet. And let's test this out. Nope. No match. No match. Come on, man. And it's not going to work. But the phone turns on. We have a survivor for now. We'll test out the sound on the camera in a couple minutes. We'll go ahead and put the S10 right there for now. And let's get the tennis max out of here. A little bit more warm liquid. And then we'll get it out. Woo! Okay, here's the phone, iPhone 10s Max, as you can see, some con condensation. And you'll flip it over in the front and the screen turned on, right? Oh, phone survived. Screen works. Going through the uh, pages here. And we'll go to the App Store. And why is it, oh, it's an airplane mode, duh. Turn that off and turn on the Wi-Fi. Okay, we'll give that a second. And then we'll do the same thing to the S10 Plus. Yeah, I don't think this fingerprint's gonna work. There we go. And we are in, right? So go ahead and turn on the Wi-Fi. And we'll let that connect. So I'm gonna go ahead and let's see. I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to YouTube real quick. And then let's see, I'm gonna search for what is this? Galaxy Watch. Don't want to connect to that right now. I'm gonna go to uh let's see. Um here we go. And then we'll test out the speaker right now. Let's go. So you can see max volume. All right, so as you can see the speaker sounds very tinny, not very loud. Let me see if I can shake the phone. All right, and then we'll try that again. Let's see if this fingerprint scanner works. Nope, no match. No match. No match. So it doesn't really like wet fingers or something? Okay, so let's try it again. Nice and loud again. So I have a feeling you let this phone completely dry out. The speakers will be just fine. So that works. We'll go ahead and uh, put my pattern in again. And then, so let's test out the screen. As you can see, scrolling is fine. Going through my pages. Let's see. Yeah, this is good. Screen is just fine. So you can see. Yeah. No issues with the screen. So let's test out the camera real quick. And then we'll take a shot of this. We'll test out all three lenses. I'll just take this quick shot. Let's see. Make sure it's in the right orientation. This is the regular lens. Bang. 2X zoom. Bang. And then this is the super wide. Bang. I'll put that in the video. Let me know of the quality, see if there's any condensation in the lens. Whoops, drop test. Any condensation in the lens, which I'll flip the phone over right now. And let's take a closer look at the camera. And you know what? I'm not seeing any condensation whatsoever in the lens. This is good. 
I think we are good on the lens. See if I can get close. Yeah, no, I'm not seeing anything. Very nice. Nice and water resistant. Okay, so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna have to say that this phone will pass this freeze test in sparkling liquid right there. So I have some left over. Very nice. Nice and durable. Cool. So let me go ahead and put the S10 Plus to the side. And we'll do the same thing to the iPhone. Actually, what am I doing? Put the S10 right here. And we'll do the same thing to the iPhone. And then the screen works. So I'm going to go ahead and go to YouTube. Let me um, just open that up real quick. And okay, we're going to skip that. And then we're going to do a search for, let's see. Here we go. We'll do a search for that. And then we'll play the same song. Max volume. Whoa. That's interesting. Okay. All right. See if I can fling fling the water off. Shake the phone a little bit. All right, let's check it out. Turn this on again and let's play. Sounds pretty good. I'm going to say the same thing that I said with the S10 Plus. You let this phone dry out com completely. I think the speakers will obviously dry out and it's going to sound just fine. So I'm going to give a pass on the speaker test on this. And let's test out the camera right meow. And then we'll just take some shots. First with the, uh, this is the 1X zoom. Let me, okay, make sure we're in the right orientation. Bang. And then we'll do it like this. Bang. I'm going to put that in the video. Let me know of the quality, see if there's any condensation in the lens. And we'll flip the phone over right now and let's have a look. And I am not seeing anything. Looking at it right now, let me know if you see anything, but looks pretty clean to me in the lens. No signs of water seeping in there or anything. Very nice. So again, camera test passed my sparkling water freeze test. I'm telling you, these phones with the IP68 rating can take a beating. And finally, one more thing. Let's test out the video recording. We'll start out with the iPhone first. I'll put this at the end of the video too. Just real quick. I'll record a quick video, maybe like five seconds. Let me know of the audio and video quality. All right, this one is the recording of the iPhone XS Max. Let me know of the quality of the audio and also the picture. Late. Okay, that's the iPhone. And do the same thing to the Galaxy S10 Plus, as you can see, this fingerprint scanner though. Okay, the phone's a little bit more dry now and my finger is a little bit more dry. So let's uh, see if this works. Nope, nope, nope. Well, that doesn't work. That's too bad. Anyway, so let's go ahead and go to the camera. We'll go to video, all right. And then let's, uh, Nope, wrong orientation. Come on, here we go. All right, and then let's play. All right, this is a recording from the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus right after the freeze test. Let me know of the audio quality as well as the video quality of the picture. All right, late. I'll put that at the end of the video also. Let me know of the quality. And that's right after coming out of the freezer. So overall, I'm gonna have to give these phones a pass. They survived the freeze test. So in real life scenario, is your phone going to encounter something like this? Well, it might if you live in a colder climate, let's say somewhere up north or it's a snow day or whatever, you leave your phone out and about, it gets snowed on and then you find it, it'll survive something like that, I'm pretty sure. Oh, one more thing, almost forgot. I forgot that these phones do have the white stone dome glass screen protector and Based on what I'm seeing right now, I think the white stone is fine. I'm not seeing any lifting or anything. 
there's a little bit right here, but that was already there prior to the freeze test. So that was already there. But other than that, I think the white stone also survived. Nice. And the screen was responsive when I was just using it. So and then we'll take a look at the S10 Plus as well. The white stone and the white stone is still on there perfectly. No lifting of the tempered glass whatsoever. So props to white stone. Probably the best tempered glass that you can get for these phones. Anyway, so let me know in the comments below what you thought about this sparkling water freeze test between the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus versus the iPhone XS Max. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Alright, this is a recording from the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus. Right after the freeze test, let me know of the audio quality as well as the